All right. Another lesson in double speech election. Um, if you ain't known by now, every president in the United States is related to each other. And George Bush is related to fucking Dracula. Like the real Dracula, Vlad the Impaler. They're related. Uh, it's insane. They're in related to Barack Obama. I mean, however that works out. It's because they're all related through Nimrod, basically. So they say. Uh, but if, if all presidents are related, so how could they just be democratically... Look, emphasis on democratically elected... If they're all related and they're all part of the same old goody boy network. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so if you ain't learned by now, presidents are not elected. They are selected. I actually voted for Al Gore before I realized how much of a propaganda flick the inconvenient truth was. The inconvenient truth is that we're being gamed on over this green, this green fraud. But... In Florida, they botched the election by Jeb, the governor, uh, messed up the voting machines and messed up all the blacks' votes and all that. So uh, the Electoral College actually took over and it won Bush. And I just realized how fraud fraudulent it was since then. And this year, it's like they give you literally no one to vote for so that you still want to... It's like, look, literally, all the people they want to elect... It would almost be better just to keep Obama in, uh, because I, I mean, he even though he's pretty bad, man, I think Jeb would be worse, Hillary would be worse, and Jeb's related also to Vlad the fucking Impaler and Obama and Hillary and Bill Clinton, uh, and uh, all of them. It's so effed up. And then you can watch my video, the first real black president in the United States, if you wish, if you really wish to know the real truth about the first black president in the United States. You can check my video, because I'm quite privy to these uh, subjects here. But anyway, elections are fraud. And like I said in the other video about democracy, how they use actually elections in communist countries that whoever's elected, but they were already selected in the first place. Whoever voted for the competition disappears in the night, or gets thrown in a work camp, a gulag, or a fun camp, like Hillary said, fun camp. See, Americans are dumb and ignorant of re-education camps. In HR 1066, HR 1066, Executive Order 66. Um, and the whole, uh, how, uh, what's his name, man? Uh, Lincoln was responsible for putting America into the Federal Emergency Management uh, or a, f a federal emergency situation. We've been in federal emergency basically under soft martial law since Lincoln. And that's why uh, to protect and serve, protect the interests of the corporatist and serve the state uh, and serve you justice from the state, which means death or beating or in, uh, being thrown in jail or tickets, whatever. <laughs> I mean, it's all bullshizzle, man. Uh... It's a big soap opera, man. It's a big game, big show. That's it. All magic.